Hello Vex, today is Monday, July 4th, so Happy Independence Day! Today I am going to be doing my book review thingy whatever for July, and so I will be talking about A Tale of Two Castles by Gail Carson Levine. This book is about a young girl named Elodie who travels to the town of Two Castles in the hopes of becoming an actress. Her plan is to get a 10 year apprenticeship because those are free and her family is too poor to pay for any of the shorter apprenticeships. However, on her way to the city, she finds out that the king has done away with the free apprenticeships. Without the money to get back home, Elodie tries to offer her services to the Actors Guild for 15 years, hoping that they'll accept the free labor. They refuse, but Elodie has caught the attention of a dragon who is a detective. It offers her a position as its assistant, and there the adventures begin. Soon, it's up to Elodie to uncover plots against an ogre who lives nearby and the king. I have to say, I really enjoyed this book. Largely because it was very much just a detective story, and it also showed Elodie's character progression in the meantime. But there was very much, you know, that mystery and figuring things out and all that. So it was a detective story mixed in with not quite a coming of age story. Maybe a coming of age story? I don't know. We see her grow up a little, but she is only 12, so she's getting there. I don't know. Another thing I like about this book is that there isn't really much romance. Which is a nice change of pace. Most of the other books I've read by Gail Carson Levine, with like the exception of David Knight, have romance in some way. But Ella Enchanted, she got with the prince in the end. Ferris, she got with the prince in the end. Ever, she got with, like, I don't even remember. Some kind of god or something. I don't remember. But she ended up with the guy. Um, the two princesses of Bamar, Bamar, I don't know how to say that title, but she ended up with like the wizard guy. This one doesn't have that. So, it's a nice change. Last, it's just a cool story. I mean, how awesome would it be to be the assistant to a dragon detective? I mean, that's just awesome. Well, that's it for this book review summary thingamajig. Um, I recommend you pick up this book. Bex, enjoy the rest of your 4th of July. I will see you on Wednesday.